Hi guys, we're gonna do a little test it out Tuesday today. Um, a friend of mine, Samantha, sent me some samples of uh, Arbonne that she sells, and I'll leave her information down below if you're interested after you've seen this review. Um, it looks like this, you've probably heard of it before. So I've been on the hunt and I've been really wanting to find a um, organic or vegan uh, makeup. I have a lot of, you know, my sisters both want to know um, some good products that are, you know, organic or vegan. And um, all of these products that I will be using from Arbonne today are, in fact, um, vegan and gluten-free. Um, so let's get started. Um, Samantha sent me some really fun stuff. Uh, the first thing she sent me is called the Re9 Advanced um, Anti-Aging Skincare Line. Um, it's a little sample. I would say it's probably good for at least one week, probably two weeks. Um, it looks like this, and then you open it up, and there's a whole bunch of fun stuff in here. Um, there is a smoothing facial cleanser, a toner, a serum, a corrective eye cream, um, a restorative day cream that's got SPF, um, a night cream, um an extra moisture day cream. So there's a regular moisture and an extra, like extra moisture day cream. So there's a whole bunch. So today um, I'm going to try um, the Intensive Renewal Serum. It's got uh, collagen supporting ingredients, uh, clinically proven to hold in moisture and help visibly firm and lift while lessening the appearance of fine lines. Hello under eyes. So I'm gonna try that today first. Um, I didn't try the, uh, uh, cleanser because I just now opened it um, so I didn't wash my face with that but I will try that and I will let you guys know how that worked out so I'm going to be um, again using the intensive renewal serum it looks like a so so there's that I'm just gonna put a little on my finger kind of looks like a little bit yellowy um, go ahead and put that on smells pretty good. It kind of has, I want to say, like a lemony scent. Feels good too. It doesn't feel greasy or oily. And yeah, I have some breakouts. Hey. Um, okay, so we did that. Um, next, she also sent me a makeup primer, which I'm really excited. Um, there's no, not a whole lot of details with this makeup primer. Um, it just says makeup primer. Um, so I'm going to try that next as my primer. Okay, so it's clear. It kind of looks like um, Smashbox, you know, their original clear uh, primer. It reminds me of that as far as, like, texture so far. Can you see it? Okay. So I put that on. It feels like it too. And I'll be honest, I'm not a big fan of the Smashbox primer. Um, I don't know what it is. It kind of makes me feel, I don't know. I know it's supposed to be like smoothing or something, but I want to say it kind of feels like greasy to the touch. I don't know. We'll try it out. Um, so from here on out, I'm going to use just do like my regular makeup, so I'll speed it up a little bit, and then I will stop when I'm using some more of the Arbonne products. So here we go.
Okay, so now we did most of my full face here. Um, so for eyes, um, Samantha was really cool and um, their little samples, which are not my total favorite as far as when you send, uh, or when, not you, but when I get sent um, little samples of eyeshadows kind of like this, but that's actually, this is really cool at first. I thought it was a pack of all the same, um, but they're actually like all very different colors. <laughs> start in with Sequoia this color down here and do that in my crease I'm gonna use my Morphe B79 like fluffy full ending brush Ooh, there's quite a bit of pigment there's a lot on my brush if you can't tell let's see how this works might be a little sloppy today but that's okay oh yeah it's definitely pigmented that's for sure I'm literally just using my camera too for my mirror, so Let's see how good this turns out. And I haven't um, really found an eye primer that I really like. Sorry, I totally just kicked the camera. Um, so I've just kind of been using my concealer. If you noticed, I kind of did that on my eyes, and I kind of just use that for my primer for my eyes. I kind of like this color. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell on this camera. just want this baby to be really nice and blended in the crease. Okay. So many options. All right, I'm gonna go in with this bottom dark color henna just really lightly and do that in the corner a little bit. I kind of am curious. There's a little bit of shimmer to it. Just dabbed it like once. Dab, sorry, that was annoying. This in the inner corner. I need a better, like, smaller, fluffy brush. But, make do with what you got. It's kind of dark. That's okay. Okay, so now, I'm going to grab a different brush. I am grabbing just, I don't know, it's BH Cosmetics brush. I've mentioned it before. It's pretty flat. Um, it's not, you know, real thick and fluffy. Um, I'm going to grab the color Sunstone. It's kind of like this light shimmery pink. I'm going to put it on like the middle towards the inner corner. Oops. Of my eyelid. to blend that in. I, I like it. I'm grabbing it. As you can tell, I'm hitting the bottom of it already. Cause it's pretty light. It's not, um, super, excuse me, pigmented. Um, so you don't need a whole lot. Or I mean you do. <laughs> but I'm totally not paying attention. All right, and then I'm gonna grab this like glitter. I'm just gonna use every color in here really quick. This, um, it's called Amber. I'm gonna just do it like right in the middle to see if it kind of makes it pop. It's pretty shimmery, so I'm gonna use the same brush. I know, I shouldn't, but I'm going to because Yeah. I dig it. 
I'm gonna um, blend it out a little bit more. I'm just gonna grab a little bit more of that sequoia down here in the corner and just blendy everybody in the club. Kind of curious to see what this looks like in a mirror. I think I like it. It feels good. Okay. So now I'm going to go do my eyeliner really quick and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to test out our bonds. It's a long story mascara. One second. Okay, I'm back. I just did my eyeliner. I just used um, Stila's Stay All Day Waterproof Eyeliner. Um, but anyway, here to go. Oh, it's right here. I am going to be using the Arbonne It's a Long Story Mascara. It came in this cute little tube. Let's see what the brush looks like. And of the big reveal. Okay, okay. I can work with this. Again, this is going to be hard to put on. In the camera, but that's okay. And then just stab myself in the eye. That's cool. Okay, so there's one eye to the other. I really like it. It looks pretty good and voluminous. Um, looking like straight on, it's like pretty good. I didn't even curl them, so that's cool. Okay. So there's one eye and the other eye. This eye's done, this eye's not. I think I like it. And again, all of these Arbonne products are vegan and gluten-free. So that's really exciting because I feel like a lot of people are starting to get into that like whole organic line and stuff, which I do think is important. Um, what goes on our skin does get absorbed and into, you know, our bodies. So I think it's totally important that we care about what we put on our face. Okay, so there's both eyes done. I think I really like it. Um, this would be something I think I would definitely use again. Um, I definitely really liked the eyeshadows. Those are really cool. I can't wait to try another um, set of colors. Um, and let's see, what else did we try? The primer. Um, you know, I said it really reminds me of uh, Smashbox, like the original clear one. I can't remember what it's called. Um, and I don't really care for that, um, but I feel like it's pretty good. I will leave comments below after wearing this all day um, just to see um, and let you guys know how I really liked it throughout the day and see if it really, you know, holds on my makeup all day. Um, so that's it. I will going to go finish my makeup with eyebrows and lips, but I hope you guys enjoy this. Again, I will leave Samantha's information down below if you're interested in ordering some Arbonne. Um, thanks again, Samantha. This is really fun. And I'm going to look at more products and see if they have, you know, foundation and concealer and stuff like that. So, yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Um, just know that I got you, boo-boo. And have a great day.